American ambassador is brutally murdered, three other Americans killed, an organized assault with automatic weapons and rocket-propelled grenades, a security request submitted four months earlier, denied, even after two bombings preceding the anniversary of 9-11, and fears of being killed expressed by Ambassador Stevens himself. Yet President Obama's officials insisted they had no actionable intelligence requiring increased security. Then, the attack, and Obama and his administration wouldn't call it terrorism for 14 days. But the evidence is piling up on Barack Obama. Within hours of the attacks, Obama officials received numerous intelligence reports indicating the attacks were organized and Al-Qaeda was involved. Communication intercepted between Al-Qaeda and Libyan militants bragging about the attack. Every sign pointed to terrorism. But for two long weeks, Obama and his team blamed a video. Why? For political reasons, it was in Obama's interest to not portray the attack as terrorism on the anniversary of 9-11. The intelligence was there. Clear signs of terrorism. But campaign politics came first. The evidence is mounting as more questions arise. What did this president know? And when did he know it? Pretty serious. What's more important, Big Bird?